What's up guys? We're out fishing again. Um, it's great to get a break from the quarantine. Uh, we took all safety precautions as I keep mentioning. We can't stress it enough to stay safe in these uh, weird times that we're having right now. We're out here with Juju, so, the man, the myth, the legend, and senior. So you know it's going to be an amazing day out here. And we're out here going to do some fishing. The smallies should be on beds and uh, maybe we'll get on a little bit of pre-spawn bite. We're out here trying to check out what it is. We're at 55 degrees water temperature and a little bit of a breeze. So we'll see. It should be an amazing day. Um, beautiful day though. It feels amazing to be out here. It's weird because since this coronavirus stuff picked up, I cherish every moment I can get outside. So if you guys are getting outside, uh, please, please, please follow the rules. Enjoy your time outside because who knows how long it's going to last if this stuff keeps spreading this might close down and if it does we're gonna abide by all laws and if we get told to stay indoors no matter what we're gonna stay indoors but as of right now we're gonna try to find some smallies on beds and hopefully we can catch some big ones it's early right now it's about seven o'clock in the morning we're gonna hit main water points and as it warms up um, we feel that they move shallow and they start covering beds and everything else catfish it was under the boat these are the kind of spots a bed normally is. Oh, he flipped it. He flipped it. Dang. Daddy. First bass of the day. Yeah, that's the first bass of the day. Look at the gut on that fish. Nice pre-spawn fish. Hasn't laid its eggs yet. It's nice and bulgy. I doubt this one was on bed. This one was more of a pre-spawn bite, I'm sure. Caught it on a main water uh, like wall here with the nice nice cliff going on with the spinner bait so what do you say probably two pounder there we go here we go back you go awesome let's do it again really quick i want to say uh, i want to give a big thank you to shop carl's for sponsoring this video awesome awesome product literally everything you need is on that website if you actually sign up as a carl's club member you can even save bigger bucks like 10 20 30 percent off baits i personally am a carl's club member and you can't beat it awesome customer service they're great people that work there also and i highly highly recommend you guys go check them out and once again i want to thank them for sponsoring this video el juju is going to catch some monsters today using it so let's get to fishing <laughs> oh man that's a big that's a big right one there. right there holy cow fish number two that was only about what um that's a minute like apart 30 30 yards from each other yeah here's a mystery tackle box really quick um i'm just curious on how long this fish is he is almost 19 inches long look at that thing that's a long one let's see how long how much he weighs three two eight three two eight it's hard to beat a three pound smallie right there look at this thing that's that's awesome right there like Lost for words. Another amazing fish here, almost 19 inches. For a smallie, I'll tell you what, this is a big fish any day, anywhere. I don't care where you're at. Another amazing fish here. I'm gonna hold it like that also to kind of show it off. Look at that, almost 19 inches. Here we go. I know she's ready. There she goes. That one was on the spinner bait also. We got a little bit of a wind kicking up. There's a lot of like big rocky stuff that goes out to the main water that's real shallow maybe about five six feet deep just cast a spinner bait uh with the wind and burn it back to the boat and it's working so we're gonna keep doing it juju hooked up nice oh man that's another fatty huh oh he's nice too yep oh, bring it bring it this way hopefully oh he's about a two pounder oh, oh man was the pressure still on him yeah, I, I saw yeah. it. He had him barely hooked with one hook on like the side of the gill plate. That's why he got Oh off. man. Almost. It was a little two pounder I saw him. I hate fishing. No. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, we saw him. He's like, I hate this. That was cool. That might have been Juju's PB Smalley though. It was stay on the same stretch right here. Yeah. We might need to turn around and keep, keep working it. That was I, awesome. I thought I was stuck at first. I didn't even know I had him. So I didn't get a good set on him, but... Yeah, you had them hooked on like with one hook on the side of the gill plate. All right, let's get them. Let's get them. We were hitting almost like a pre-spawn bite on the main water points and these stretches uh, where shallow water's near deep water. And uh, the bass were sta they're kind of staging up right there. We're throwing, you know, spinner baits, jerk baits and stuff. Like Juju, you can see here, he's, he was throwing us, uh, actually a jerk bait. 
and this is what he just lost his fish on so cool things like this that can kind of get a reaction strike for these hungry bass are working great got two in the boat so far yeah we got two in the boat so far so now we're gonna look for some beds all right guys so we're, we're back here um in this cove we're literally seeing bedded bass everywhere just having a hollabaloo the time of our <laughs> time of our lives catching them now but uh we're back here fishing these bedfish we're actually fishing one right now that's sitting right over there he's a small one it's a little oh, it's oh he just you just rolled him yeah oh well he's a little male so it's still fun to catch him so we're gonna give him a little bit of time so you just roll them see if we can't catch him but uh great time i mean there's there's a lot of empty beds too but literally like almost all of them have at least a bass in it some males some females so you know, we're just fishing things like this texas rig right here senior's got a drop shot on with a hula grub uh juju's fishing the ned rig oh he's not bad that's actually not a bad fish he looks a lot smaller than what he is you guys could see him definitely with the gopro here for some reason he had no problem with the crawl he had no problem with the hula grub he has a okay, problem with that ned rig oh 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 he likes when it's fast yeah he likes when you jig it hard so put it over his bed and jig it like two big jigs and then let it sink real fast into his the middle of his bed watch that works a lot. Let it go down. And give it a good jig into his bed. There okay. you go, there you go. Again. Nope. Look, he's looking at us. He's like, come on, guys. Really? Really? <laughs> That's probably another solid two pounder, two and a half pounder. I keep underestimating the size of these bass, though. That rod's in the way. You got it. You got it. Uh, he had it. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, you could tell he had it because he bent the Ned rig. This bass is crazy. He won't get off this bed. He's not extremely aggressive, which usually they are if they refuse to leave their bed. But. This is the one. There you go. You can see the Ned rig. Oh, 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 got him. Holy cow. He's not bad either. Bring, bring oh, that was nice. Oh. Where's he at? Watch out. Put your rod tip down so the line don't rub the boat. Yeah. Oh, jeez. I thought he was tiny, but he's all right. He's a good one. The two pounders. Yeah. Nice. Nice work. I got all that on film. You can see the Ned rig. You can I see. You that was the one tail out. Oh, you can see the Jew rig. Sorry. You can see Juju's rig. <laughs> the crazy Jew rig. And, uh,. Man, that one's got red eyes. Ah, look how red his eyes are. He's evil. He's yeah. Look at, hold him up real quick. There you go. Let me put hold this. It. Grab him and hold him so we can look at his eyes. Jeez, hold. Look at those eyes really quick. Jeez. Man, hold. Let's see if we can get in focus. There we go, man. Those eyes are crazy. That's a that's a good looking one right there though. Nice fish. I didn't think he was worth catching, but one hey. TikTok caught a vampire fish. That one's worth catching. This is crazy you here, and I just caught a vampire fish. Look at those eyes. It's a keeper. Nice. That was for Juju's TikTok. <laughs> nice, Ju. How many followers do you have now? 16.3 thousand. 16.3? Yep. Dang, Diego's blowing up. Holy cow. That's good, though. Awesome. TikTok fan. Alright, we see a large mouth on a bed here. Adrian hooked on to him. He broke loose, but he is very aggressive. He's tucked way back there. I can actually see him on the camera. So there's a large on a bed down there. Let's see if you could pitch a lure in there. Oh, almost. He tangled around the bush. It makes it a little harder. But we'll see. Oh, you got him? I'm trying to whack him. I didn't know whether to duck or run. I ducked. Largey on a bed. This cast has to be perfect. So I gotta... It's very hard cast to make. Well, you're right above him, but you ain't gonna land him if you <laughs> hook him through all them trees. Oh, oh. He's looking. That's actually perfect. Oh, oh, he grabbed it, yeah. Yep, oh, yep, yep. Man. You gotta go to him. You gotta go to him. Oh, man. You might lose him. 
Make sure you reel what you go to. That was the dang one. We're going in fast. We're going in fast. You gotta net him, okay? Yeah, net him. We'll go, forget go, go, about go. the line. Just get him. Okay. Hold tree and everything. Hold tree and everything. Underneath. 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 Oh! Pull him up. Lego line and then back up. This is a thorn bush. Watch out. Oh. That's a thorn bush. <laughs> That was a thorn bush. Ow. Ow. Here, hold up. Look at it. We're up. in this thick stuff. They're lying everywhere. Hold up. <laughs> Juju just took some battle scars. Uh, yeah, he's probably about a two, two and a half. Nah, maybe pushing three, maybe. 275. It's all right. That's a good one. He's probably three pounds. Yeah, now that I look at him up close, that's three pounds probably. Yeah, he's two seventy five. three pounds. You want to just get a quick little weight or nay? Go ahead. Oh, yeah. 297. 297 right here. Three pounder. Look at that thing. Sweet. Beautiful fish. Awesome. Let's release this guy. Three pounder. I can't beat that right there. Let's release this dude. There you go. Oh yeah. He's still healthy. Yeah, that's It'll a good go one. back to the bed. Awesome. Nice job, guys. Let's show him what you caught that. I'll show him what you caught it on. But these Carl's amazing baits right here, when you Texas rig one of these, man. Then th those bass cannot stand it on their beds. This is what he just caught that large on. We actually hooked them twice with these. And a lot of the smallies I'm catching on beds are actually on these right here. So definitely got to pick yourself up some of these from um, Carl's Bait and Tackle. So amazing bait right here. I really do, really do like this. As you guys can see there, nice little crawl. I got a heavy metal tungsten weight, bullet weight, and then just a nice hook. So nice Texas rig just getting it done. I went over a branch and it dropped right on him and he just whacked it. So that's like worst case scenario. Look, oh. there's a big fish right there. Oh, geez, that's a Huge big fish. small one. What bed was he on? Oh, two of them. All right, so we're actually moving coves right now. I want to give a big, big thank you to Shop Carls for sponsoring this video. Um, everything we use is off their website. If you guys actually go on their website, you can sign up as something they call a Carls Club member and you can save big, big bucks. Uh, off all your tackle needs basically. I personally am a Carl's Club member and I save a lot of money um, shopping on their website. So I highly recommend you guys go on there. You can save, you know, 10, 20, 30% off amazing baits and come out here and catch fish like we are. So uh, once again, thank you to Shop Carl's for sponsoring this video. Juju really appreciates it also because he's going to be catching some big fish with some of those lures. Still put it in the water. It's gone. <laughs> Bring him to it. Oh, <laughs> Finally. Jew. He ain't no big as a day, but he's good. Yeah, he's good. Three times, man. We came back. We had to. We can't let this fish beat Juju like that. <laughs> <laughs>